Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To view an image, you must first open the photo or image that you want to view. To do this, select File and then Open from the menu bar. And that will launch the Open dialog box, which we saw in a previous lesson. And here you can use the Look In drop-down at the top of the dialog box to select which folder within your computer's file system you wish to look within for your image files. So we'll give that a click and we'll go down to C because we're looking on our C drive. You can then double click the folders in this window to open them and see their contents in the window. And we'll locate the file that we want under Adobe, Photoshop CS5, and we'll select our samples folder that comes preloaded with this application. Now once you're looking inside of the folder that contains the image that you want to open, you should see the names of the images in the list window in the dialog box. We see those below those images. Now if you have many different files, you can filter them by the type of file by using the Files of Type drop-down at the bottom of the dialog box. Located right here, right now it's defaulting to all formats, but you could select any of these particular formats if you so wish. Then you can double click an image to open it in Photoshop. So for example, this fish image right here but you could also just click it once to select it and then click the open if you wish to do that as well in the lower right hand corner of the box to open it. Now if the image that you want to open is one that you recently opened you can select file and then open recent from the menu bar and then in the side menu that appears you'll see the names of the most recently opened image files in Photoshop and if you click on a name in this list to select it, it will reopen the file for editing. So we could slide over here and select it and it will open it as well. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.